as far as working with our students, Messiah students, I just think these, these trips, the aroma trips, they, they make an absolute, um, just, you know, groundbreaking, like, earth flipping upside down type of impact on our students. Of sin and darkness, whose love is mighty and so much stronger, the King of Glory, the King of Glory. Two years ago, I believe, we there was a team that went over with a bunch of sticks, and my coach went over and they taught basics of field hockey. So some places they were like, oh, we learned about this once or twice. So it was fun. For some people, they never saw a stick before, so. Showing them just how to dribble and the joy they had, it was like, yes, this is why I love the game. This is amazing grace. This is unfailing love. At halftime of one game, I got to share to, to like, like thousands of Ugandans my testimony. An old man came up to accept Christ, and that was a really humbling experience because it was just like, you like he could live his whole life apart from Christ and now that he realized like that Jesus is the way he's saved and he's like free from anything he did in the past. We noticed this girl who uh, her right eye was white uh, um, like there's no I don't know there's no color to it and I guess, okay, I guess over there they call it white eye out of the Holy Spirit just working my heart I just told her that she was beautiful and her eye kind of rolled into place and all of a sudden she had like two eyes and, like she could see things and I, I, we were just in awe like sat there like kind of crying kind of worshiping just like in awe of, of what God was doing and how he was using us it was amazing the king above all kings. As a wrestling coach in Uganda, Uganda's not a real big wrestling country, um, so we were stretched, um, the, the two wrestlers and me as a coach, we were stretched, um, but Josh and Lucas would, would stand on the outside skirts of the soccer games, and they would start doing these performances, and they, just, they looked like circus performers, they were doing flips and jumps and push up with guys on their back and all this different stuff, but the crowd was so into it. They found a way to use I mean, performance, athletic performance, athleticism um, to, you know, break down kind of different cultural barriers and start conversations and make friends, I guess. Um, so um, we found a good way to use our talents, I guess, even though we were using wrestling specifically. Worthy is the Lamb who was slain. Worthy is the King.